Hi everyone, we're here at John Sellers Auto Repair. Today we have a 2007 GMC Sierra 5.3 liter. Customers complained as they wanted a second opinion about the driver's front wheel bearing being worn out and the inner tie rods uh, on the steering rack being worn out. So I went for a test drive with the consumer. There's no noise whatsoever, but I did notice a big lack of power with the vehicle. I got the vehicle back to my repair shop. I jacked it up. The front wheel, there's no movement, there's no noise. The inner tie rod, there's no play. I did notice the outside of the steering rack was damp at the bottom of it, and I'll show you what I found out. So if you look straight down here, and you look at the connection, let me get a light on the angle for you here. Where that, right where that boot, right where the steering knuckle, and that's where it goes in the rack and pinion. You can see the top of that boot, it's all damp. And so that means it's been seeping or weeping. You know, it's not actually just running out, but it's wet. And so one of the things that can cause that is if it has bad power steering fluid. So I took some power steering fluid out of it. I'll put some on my other hand here. It's supposed to be kind of a clear color. As you can see, it's dark brown and it smells terrible. So next, I looked at the throttle plate and looked inside of here and it's jet black inside of there, jet black behind there. So I know the fuel injection cleaning will make it run a lot better. Then after that, on these cars that have mass air flow sensors, <clears throat> there's a wire, three wires inside of here that measure the speed and the temperature of the air going into the engine. But when they get all full of dirt, then they don't work very well anymore and they, and they set, set false readings. So I just buy the CRC product. It's a cleaner made just for mass airflow sensors to clean them. And then we're going to use some BG product. We're going to suction some power steering fluid out, add the conditioner, and clean that area. So the end result is we're going to get the customer's vehicle driving incredibly better. We're going to hopefully get that, that seeping and weeping of the power steering fluid get the new conditioner in there and get the system working better. And then if it works good, we'll go ahead and change the fluid on it. And then we'll do the fuel injection cleaning. She's gonna just be so happy with her vehicle. And it's always good to get a second opinion. Always trust your intuition, get a second opinion. Thank you very much.